Right now, the Bronx is experiencing 16 degree weather and the city is urging New Yorkers to prepare for extreme cold. Helping Bronx sites prepare, Assemblywoman Latoya Joyner is giving away coats at the Bronx Terminal Market. Today is extremely frigid cold weather and we are happy to host here at Bronx Terminal Market our coat giveaway and hand sanitizer giveaway. In partnership with NYC Cares, the Assemblywoman handed out PPE and 3,000 coats of all sizes to local Bronx families. Naming the event Coats Against COVID, Joyner says her mission is to keep the community safe this winter. We have many families lined up that are here trying to get you know, coats for their families, their young ones to stay warm. This giveaway is just one of many happening in the Bronx. Since the beginning of the pandemic, an increasing number of resource outlets like food and coat giveaways have been helpful to families in the borough. Many of our families are struggling. You know, they're struggling at home with remote learning. They're struggling to put food on their tables. They're struggling to get through their work day. They're struggling to get through this whole process of, you know, new feelings of isolation. And, and we're just here today to let them know that they're not alone. Families left with one adult coat and two coats for children. Taking the time to assist these families, Bronx site and Deputy Chief of Staff for Joiner's Office, Charlene Matos, speaks on the importance of giving back. Growing up in the Bronx, you know, living around this area, seeing so many people underserved and not represented, it's good to like give back to the community and be behind the scenes actually like supplying people with coats. It's all about being good neighbors, being good partners, listening to one another, and stepping up for each other um, during times of need. To stay updated on events and more giveaways, you can visit Joiner's Instagram and Facebook at Join Joiner or call their office at 718-538-2000. Reporting for BronxNet, Kibinoline.